Hi, it's Bonnie Dye, and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a page private on your WordPress website. A lot of times you might be working on things you're not ready to have your site visitors see yet. So the first thing you need to do is go to the page that you want to make private. And this part's really easy. It's just over on the right hand side where it says visibility and it's marked public. Simply click edit and then click private. Click OK and then click update. Now one thing that's a little confusing to people is that once we've done that, we should expect to go to our live site, refresh the site, and then not be able to see the content. What happens is it is marked private, but you can still see the content. The reason for that is because we're still logged in to the dashboard in the back area, and it gives us editing privileges as long as we're logged in back there. So as soon as you logged out, you're, log out, you're going to see a, what's called a 404 error, page not found. This is what your site visitor is going to see. Before we log out, the other thing that's a good idea to do when you're working on a page and don't want anybody to see it is to go to the menus and simply remove that page from your menu. Don't forget to save menu once you've done that. And then once we've done that, it's okay to go ahead and log out. Go back to look at your live site. When we click refresh, we see a very quick glance at the 404 error and then the website automatically bounces, bounces your site visitor back to the home page. So even if I type in the direct URL, if I type in trying to go to the about page, maybe you've got some marketing out there that people are going to use that URL, it's still going to show the 404 error and then bounce your site visitor back to the home page because you don't have an about tag. I hope this helps. If you have uh, qu other questions or need further information, feel free to contact me through my website, which is eTrainingLive.com. Take care.